18 naked cowboys in the showers at Ram Ranch. Everybody knows the classic song Ram Ranch by Grant McDonald. But what everybody doesn't know is that there are currently over 400 sequel songs to this original masterpiece. With every new sequel song in the series, there is more and more lore added to the Ram Ranch universe. For a newcomer looking to jump into this series, it may seem quite intimidating and a very daunting task to get caught up on over 400 songs to learn all of this complex lore. So in today's video, I aim to break down the first chapter of the Ram Ranch core story to hopefully make jumping into this expansive Ram Ranch universe a bit easier for newcomers. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the story of Ram Ranch 1 through 9. So, before we jump right into it, there are a couple things I should mention. First, the reason why I have Ram Ranch's 1 through 9 listed as chapter 1 of the story is because Grant himself has released a compilation of all these songs together on one album simply called Ram Ranch 1 through 9. Because of this, they are clearly meant to be together to tell the first part of the Ram Ranch story. Secondly, we are only going to be looking at Grant's songs that are officially part of the Ram Ranch core story and not the extended universe. Now what do I mean by this? Well, Grant has quite the discography of songs, so we will only be looking at the ones with Ram Ranch in their titles. Maybe one day we can jump into the expanded universe together, but for now we will just be focused on the core story. Now with that out of the way, let's start from the beginning with the original Ram Ranch. The original Ram Ranch mostly just introduces us to the setting of the story, Ram Ranch itself and what it is like on the ranch. The song introduces us to a total of 36 cowboys at the ranch with there being 18 naked cowboys in the showers with 18 more cowboys out in the yard. The song also goes into great detail about how much the Ram Ranch cowboys love cock and being fucked by each other. Other than that though, we don't get any more information about the ranch itself or any of the unique characters on the ranch. With this being the song that started the franchise in its entirety, it makes sense that Grant would leave room to further grow and expand his universe in the sequel songs. This song acts as the prologue, setting the stage for everything that will come in the series. Yeah, big herd Ramcock, Ryan and Dave, you through, boy. Ramcock, Ram, deeper and deeper and deeper, deeper and deeper and deeper. Ram Ranch 1, in my opinion, is the most forgotten part of the series. When everyone thinks of Ram Ranch 1, they usually think of the original, but this is actually a completely separate and distinct entry into the series. This part of the story is meant to give the listener an idea of what it is like at Ram Ranch to try to help immerse them into the world of Ram Ranch. It is told in the second person, using words like you and yours, and is a one-on-one -on -one encounter with you and another unknown Ram Ranch cowboy. You are being used and fucked by this unnamed Ram Ranch cowboy, doing all the things Ram Ranch cowboys regularly do. This is the first entry in the series where the cock size is stated to be 12 inches. Not much else is learned in this entry, as it is mostly used to try to increase immersion. Yes, 36 wild Ram Ranch cowboys with huge herd cocks, hard as rocks. Ram Ranch 2 has 36 Ram Ranch cowboys just like the original, but this time they are all in the bunkhouse instead of being split into two separate groups. This entry mostly reaffirms how much the cowboys love cock and being fucked by each other, but adds one new detail not yet known in the series. The Ram Ranch cowboys love swallowing loads and loads of cum. It is also the first in the series to use gay porn noises in the music, which has almost always been a staple of Grant's music. Wild Ram Ranch Cowboys out in the yard. Ram Ranch 3 has the Ram Ranch Cowboys all getting fucked in the yard, with some of the cowboys teaching other cowboys how to suck and fuck. It also mentions the cowboys having 12 inch cocks, so with this new information, because in Ram Ranch 1 it was only one other cock size mentioned, we could deduce that the average cock size of a Ram Ranch Cowboy is around 12 inches. For the first time in the story, at the end of the song, two of the 36 cowboys are named. Luke and Sean are two of the 36 total cowboys. Yeah, Ram Ranch Rodeo Boys. Ram Ranch 4 introduces us to a new type of Ram Ranch cowboy, the Rodeo Boys. This shows that Grant is adding more depth and layers to the Ram Ranch universe by adding different types of Ram Ranch cowboys. 
This entry also builds off of the ending of Ram Ranch 3 and is mainly about the character Sean. Sean is confirmed to have a 12 inch cock, which is not surprising since the average cock size at Ram Ranch is 12 inches. It also shows that Sean is one of the most popular cowboys at the ranch as he regularly has other cowboys lining up waiting for him to fuck them. Thirty-six Ram Ranch Cowboys in the Ram Ranch pool. Ram Ranch 5 has the 36 Ram Ranch Cowboys getting fucked at the Ram Ranch pool. So far on the ranch, we know that there are showers, a yard, a bunkhouse, and now a pool. This is the first Ram Ranch that says there are young cowboys at the ranch. So this means that there could be cowboys as young as 18. Yeah, Prince Harry, getting butt fucked in Jasper, Canada. Ram Ranch 6 introduces us to a very important character in the story, Prince Harry. It is stated that he is with 18 Ram Ranch cowboys and he loves being fucked by them. Because of the distinction of the 18 cowboys being completely distinct from him, we can deduce that Prince Harry is not an official Ram Ranch cowboy. It is confirmed that Prince Harry's cock size is 12 inches nonetheless. This song takes place in Jasper, Canada, which may be the location of Ram Ranch, but we don't know for sure because the song just says with Ram Ranch Cowboys, not at Ram Ranch. Yeah, 28 US Marines. Ram Ranch 7 is the main climax of Chapter 1. Ram Ranch is now under siege by 28 US Marines while they all look for Prince Harry. Big Mantis and Cobra are the leaders of the Marines, and some of the other Marines who are also there are Mac the Whopper, Andrew, Connor, Long Dick Brennan, Trevor, Greg, Justin, Jimmy Sheffield, and Big Meat Brian Andrews. The Marines are from Woodbury, Connecticut. Sean is confirmed to be one of the Cowboys being fucked by the Marines. It is also confirmed that the US Marines all have 12 inch cocks. In an amazing turn of events, 36 more Ram Ranch Cowboys ride in from the range to help fend off the Marines. They fuck the Marines and successfully defend Ram Ranch. This event confirms that there are more than 36 total Ram Ranch Cowboys and the actual number of Ram Ranch Cowboys is currently unknown. Yeah, Andela. Ram Ranch 8 introduces Andela with his 12 inch black cock and he is fucking Prince Harry in the Ram Ranch showers. There are 17 other Ram Ranch Cowboys in the showers also getting fucked by Andela and it is stated that they have virgin buttholes. Since Prince Harry has been confirmed to have been fucked during Ram Ranch 6, it is still safe to say that he is not an official Ram Ranch Cowboy and that he is just accompanied by 17 other Ram Ranch Cowboys in the showers. Using the same logic, we can also confirm that Andela is not a Ram Ranch Cowboy himself. Yeah, Ram Ranch Cowboys at the Rodeo in West Virginia. Ram Ranch 9 takes place at a rodeo in West Virginia. Honestly, not a lot of story development happens in this one. After the successful defense of Ram Ranch during Ram Ranch 7, I think the Ram Ranch Cowboys went to the rodeo in West Virginia for some well-deserved rest and relaxation. While they are at the rodeo, they have a good time fucking some West Virginia boys. One of my theories about the story so far is that Ram Ranch 7 and 8 roughly take place at the same time. Since in Ram Ranch 7 it is confirmed that there are more than 36 total Ram Ranch Cowboys, it is possible. Maybe the Marines never actually made it into the Ram Ranch showers to find Andela and Prince Harry and the other 17 Cowboys in there. The 36 Cowboys that rode in from the range came back just in time before Prince Harry could be found. But who knows, that's just a theory. A Ram Ranch theory. Thanks for watching. Cow-tay ship was a gun. Hiding from